and it's time for us to head straight into this awesome telephonic interview with the amazing Lucky uh, Hosimang to talk to us about his uh, uh, initiative called uh, called Lemao uh, Lilimunati uh, Charity Walk, and he's joining me right now uh, on the line to talk to us about that and what is it all about and uh, how we as uh, South Africans that actually can be part of it and also probably must definitely help him out. Hello, Lucky, how are you doing? I'm all good and you. I am awesome. Happy Thursday. Happy Puzo Thursday. <laughs> it's, uh, it's indeed a wonderful uh, Thursday. We are thirsty. <laughs> yeah, very thirsty, you know. I very thirsty. You have Black Friday, ir coco, so it means that, you know, hey, sh- we can afford it. We can afford it now. <laughs> we can finally afford it. Definitely, definitely. Those those bottles and nice little things get us pretty But uh, lucky, uh, uh, Mang, welcome to Radio TF. Could you just introduce yourself to the listeners and just uh, tell them uh, who you are, where you're from, and what you are all about as well. Um, well, my name is um, Lakio Kotiman. Uh, let me first by um, saying, you know, Dumela to your listeners. Yeah. Uh, or La Retobela. Ra, 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 <laughs> La Locha. La uh, My name is Lakio Kotiman. Um, I'm basically from a very, very small town in, 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 in South Africa called Europe. It's a one three town. A lot of people don't know about it. That's the way I was born. That's where I was bred. And that's where basically, you know, the person of everything that I do comes from. Mm. Ah, man, I've known you for a hot minute, though, so. <laughs> <laughs> Which kind of plays into my favor is to, I'm not speaking to a stranger. I'm speaking to someone yeah. that I've known in the industry for quite some time. But talk to us, uh, uh, I want to say, because uh, I wanted us to talk about your initiative uh, quick, quick, but uh, before we actually do talk about your initi- initiative, uh, I want to quick, quick, and pay the bills, and then we'll be right back. Just hold still going to continue right now with this awesome interview with uh, Mr. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, Hussie Mang, who is a lucky, who's still on the line to talk to us about his initiative, uh, the charity walk co- called uh, Limmao Limunati Charity Walk, and he's still on the line uh, joining us. So welcome back, Comrade. Welcome, welcome back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, okay. Uh, let's talk about the uh, your initiative and the reason behind it. Why did you yeah. start this initiative, and why is it so important? Um, so we we started this initiative because we thought, like um, you know, the the, the hands that receive are common, and the hands that give are really really rare. So what we said was, what can we do to, to give back to our community, give back to, to the society at large? And that's how the Malala Monate started. It actually started as a radio station where I was doing a motivational uh, talk segment for about 10 minutes, then went to motivational talking or speaking at high schools and schools around Paris. And then it became the thing that we figured we could raise funds using Lamar Lemonati where we could do this um, annual walk um, for about 30 kilometers to raise funds for the underprivileged uh, kids around our community. Mm. So uh, how, how does, talking about the communities and, uh, and, and the, uh, the, 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 uh, the helping uh, the underprivileged kids, I want to know how does the initiative help the community in, in general? Uh, and... Uh, Looking at the fact how what else are you doing for the community as well? Um, so um, like specifically we we do motivational talks that that specifically from primary school kids, high school kids. Then the the, the, the other thing that we are doing is we we look at uh, orphanage. We're working closely with this orphanage where every year we try and go back to this open age where, uh, especially in December, you have kids that don't have parents or they're from abusive homes, and we try and make the, uh, uh, the Christmas a little bit better, a little bit merrier by buying presents, buying food for them from, from the family. 
chance that that, that we raise uh, from the from this initiative. So we we work. I think may not. I think, but mostly with with, with the kids uh, in our project. So uh, I want to know what are some of the activities that will be happening uh, to uh, at the uh, at the charity walk? Because I know it's not as for just for walking. And not just for walking the hungry week, just going there just to walk. No, I know there are other activities that you guys will be doing. What other things would you guys be doing? Um, so on the day um, from um, from our community, we, we have um, a basketball game where we bring uh, guys who are really, uh, um, you could say, drug addicts or drug addicts, uh, people who are uh, recovering from, from drugs. Um, um, so we have like a, a, a game, a, a basketball game, where kids could come and play basketball and could do other indigenous uh, uh, games that Borikeso, Borikeso, Bokotamukamokala, Lekhati are one of those things that um, that we do on the day. Nice. So the the walk is about 30 kilometers away from from Zeres. So it's similar from there is going towards to Mati King for about 30 kilometers then we go back to there to to now start with with these all other games for the kids. Kikoro Mutu San Kora Abe feet Dimos. Hey Mutu San Abe feet. I'm actually uh that's how we're taking this seriously. Every day after work for about an hour or two I walk, I jog so that uh, on the day I give back to my time. <laughs> I can only imagine because I'm like thinking to myself, would I make a 30? Would I make it? Would I make it? 30 k hey. I mean, this, this is our uh, second annual walk. We did it last year. Yeah. Uh, myself and my partner called Mitoko Nolo uh, Musiele, mm. the guy who introduced me to, to radio. Um, he's a guy living with disability, mm. right? Mm. And we did this walk last year and we started at 6. And we finished around, uh, I think it was around one o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> and it was it, it was a literally six seven hour walk. Uh, uh, I comrades, let me tell you, let me tell you, uh, instead of the walk, ne, I know that yeah. there's probably a way I can donate rather than walk. So, <laughs> <laughs> to avoid the walk, compatriots, how can we? Those that are so, in Limpopo, how can we, <laughs> since we can't make it to the how can we help you no. donate? Oh, well, let me just, uh, let me just boost. Hey, seven hours. Yay. Yeah. Hey. hey. No, man. It's a lot. It's, it's a, a lot. lot. So, so this is, that's, 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 that's the other thing that people can do. So we say, cool, what we committed to do. Ronarily to as, as the, the co-founders of this movement, mm. we will definitely walk six, seven hours. And then people who, who really want to be part of this will, will be engaging Lebanese through TikTok, through uh, Facebook, live, uh, to say, hey, you, you are here and you are part of this. And they can pledge as well. So they can pledge anything from 20 rand to 100 rand uh, to, to the movement. That, 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 it's very simple. That's very simple. So yeah, I, it's, <laughs> it's very simple. I know that one I can do, no problem. But uh, uh, where on social media uh, can they find you guys as well as donate uh, uh, to the charity walk? And since we cannot be part of it physically, but mm, financially mm. we can at least try five rand Yes. So I mean, that five rand banyana, ten rand banyana will take us a long way. Um, <laughs> So we, we will be on uh, TikTok under uh, uh, Mona Wamutwana, that's the handle. Mm -hmm. uh, on Facebook, we will be under the Mao Lele Monazi account. So we will be using these two accounts to really uh, track our movement for those who will be placing money for Rona for the reward, okay, you know? To say, hey, at least it was Wabasa Mayamo, Wawa. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, and um, we currently working on our Twitter handle and our IG handle because we want to upload as many pictures as we can of the walk and of, of you know, uh, donating whatever that we would have bought for, for the orphanage and for the schools. So, uh, 
uh, before we do say our, our, our goodbyes, who is most? Who are the people that are invited? Who can come to this event? So anyone who feels they can walk, can they come through? You are invited to this. Uh, we are working closely with the Department of Traffic, so that of not of, of transport, so that people can can walk on the end. I think it's the N4, yes, it's the N4 to Murphy King. Uh, so anyone is invited, they can come through. Uh, if you can't come through, please, 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 by all means, donate to the movement. And we will be, you know, being honest and walking this for seven hours. Oh, man. I wish I could actually yeah. be there. I actually think I could do the 30K, but if only at least I had, like, uh, fun people. I know that we'll be wearing, you know, that's <laughs> what we fun walk. We are all wearing tutus and the pink yeah. tutus. You know, we have we have glitter on our faces. We have bunny rabbits you know, on. It's a whole lot of fun. And it's a whole lot of fun. You know what I mean? I wish I could be there so so much. But all I can do is just help with donation because of the fact that I feel Khuri, this is an amazing initiative. Uh, this is an amazing yeah. charity uh, charity walk. It's called uh, Limau yeah. Lemun, uh, Munati. And uh, yeah. I see why you guys decided to have this charity walk to help uh, uh, to help underprivileged kids. And it's very important yeah. that we do help our kids because of the fact that yeah. their future so is in that's, their hands. That's in a nutshell. Yeah. So uh, thank you so much for coming through. I told you you'll be okay. Okay, I told you. Oh, yeah. hello, um, hey. So, Kilebuki um, Tata, I would like to thank you for this for this platform. Uh, I would like to thank your listeners, Kibare Kere Kilebuki Le Kudu Kudu, for for the service of Hone, Le Hore Le Batare Teka. I really, really appreciate it, and we appreciate it as the Manila Monati. All right, have a great afternoon. But before you leave, we're leaving you with a song by Beyonce.